guys. Smile with your own candid camera. <laughs> Got a couple of new faces in my channel, pop them up. How about you introduce yourselves, my man? I'm John. Nice to meet you, John. And who have we got over here? I don't know who he is. I'm <laughs> Who's this guy? Hey guys, that Scottish Wanderer, man, is that no? He used to have a seat. <laughs> but, but that's, that's the but joke. Yeah. What are you that's sitting on, Stuart? The seat. The seat. That should look as if you're on your hunkers the way the camera's got you. Oh, not bad. And we have this something coming, bright star. <laughs> Call Russell Scottish Wild Camper, you know what they say, get your subs in there! <laughs> <laughs> I forgot to mention, I'm now, a, I'm now a YouTuber myself, further back up and coming star, Just John Outdoors. Just John Outdoors. 51 subscribers! <laughs> Let's get him to 100 at least, folks. Yes, thank you. Yeah, I think you should take on a competition and catch up with this Colin guy. Oh, well. <laughs> and who have we got here? Yeah, and I'm Glenn. Glenn. Just Glenn. Good to see you again, mate. It's been well, a wee while. We're joining with a couple others soon, aren't we? We've been out a few times, haven't we, Mark? Oh, aye. Who else is to come then? We've got Bugsy. Bugsy, Bugsy still to come. And your Bugsy. man up here. So, did you get what I'm doing? In fact, I've all got to get my stuff. Alright, the fire's yeah. on the way. It's only about quarter to five and it's already dark. I know. This is where we're getting. The wood's piled up. And so it begins. you make all these, sure. Colin? I did. Who's this there? Did you make them, Vessel Colin? Right? Yours? Yeah. We found that with Frankincense Golden Muff. Can I get the pestle, Colin? I just held it myself. It's not a pretzel, it's a pestle. Pes <laughs> pe <laughs> you know that I'm an idiot, Kevin. I'm not talking about my wood turning. What's it called? Pestle and mortar. Or cooks her. Or petrol max. That's it. That's a petrol max. I could do it. You'd not be able to, because these are all. Well, I've got Bugsy joining us. How you doing? No bad, mate. Good to see you. Alright. Petromax. <laughs> Stuart, there's no Christmas Day, Camden. <laughs> Petromax. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm claiming that. Right, that's mine's all mine's. Petromax. Petromax. I'm claiming Especially it. Especially designed. Actually, I prefer that one, you know. Oh, somebody's claimed that one. Yeah, me. <laughs> that's cracked, that one. No, no, I don't want that anymore. Right, mate, look. You make me a better one, Tom. Come on, I'm gonna make it. You make I'm me a cooker. Oh, 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 oh,
Sitting here with the food coming out. Nobody's judging you. Yeah. Well, yeah, just heating the pies up for a few minutes. Oh, is it curry pie you say, John? Chicken curry pie, homemade. Hell, the rain's on. Moment of truth. Mmm. Nice, John. Not just saying that, it's lovely. Mmm. That's a good pie. I'll get my waterproof jacket over the waterproof over the down. We'll see about getting the tarps up. Right in there. Let me see. 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 Let Right, it's not far off. Can't be. Oh, it's ready, guys. Right. The potatoes. Right, uh, right. What's need to trip all this in? Just in case I might get a wee bit of bone, because the crown's oh. just got, it's got the, start, the top of the, bre the rib cage on it, the, the breast, you know? Right, take a breath. Mm. Damn, wait, no, do. <laughs> I think maybe Christmas dinner's going to be an anti-climax after endless. that. <laughs> Wait a minute. Dude, what's almost turned left? Thanks, Jack. Maybe second. Ho, ho, ho. Right, time to pull a cracker. Right. Pour the rain on a night. It's nice, a Christmas dinner. But it's Christmas cracker time. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. Oh, he's hey. one another Too much light, man. Too much light. Let me go at it. Eh. Uh, mmm. That's a. Uh, I don't know what that is. Colin. Get it, Mark. <laughs> jingle bells. Jingle bells. Oh, jingle bells. Batman bells. Run away. Whoa. Ready to get the Batman bells. 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 The Batman Steam is coming right off the clothing. Uh, it's all a little bit wet, but I'm in the car. Let's see what you can see the back window. It's still outside. It's the front. You know, it's been the first in a few months, and I have to admit, the more I do it, the more cosy it is. I've got the X bed on top of the Aldi mat, so I've got two. And I copied uh, what Scotland's Mountains Murray was saying about letting a little bit of air out the X bed. So I've done that just to see if I sink in better and get a good night's sleep. My back's not the best these days. And uh, I've got a good big mattress at home that I've spent a lot of money on. Uh, so let's see how this goes. You get some heat back in me. Well, the clothing's a, a little bit damp still. Sleeves of the down jacket and even right my underwear that was exposed before I got my waterproofs on. 
But uh, it's all good. No put me off whatsoever. Still got my Christmas hat on. <laughs> so uh, just about to say goodnight and I'll see you in the morning. Then I get a lot of footage done. The GoPro just can't do anything in the night time. The phone wouldn't be doing anything uh, with this f iPhone. Even just moving the little light bulb that's in my hand, you know. Good wee thing this, it can be charged USB and it came with the wee solar thing. I think I got it off a wish for a few quid. But if I turn the light off, you cannot see me. Let there be light. So uh, I was looking to get a new lens for the Nikon camera. See if I can get some darkness because I want I get good campfire footage, you know, in the woods and stuff. I miss the woods. Uh, and the, the dinner they had tonight with that turkey and all the trimmings just looked amazing with the Dutch oven. I've used mine once or twice. And even then, it was over a year ago. So the way my new working shift is permits me to be off three days per week, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So there's at least two nights I'd be camping each week if I wanted without other things coming up. So see what happens into the new year. Looking forward to a good night's sleep. It's been a long day and hopefully that's me until the morning. See you then. It's lights out, all out. Morning neighbour. You sleep all right? Sorry? Did you sleep all right? I slept like a log, it was a great night. Good, good. I woke up a couple of times just with the, with the, the noise of the hail and the rain on it, but apart from that, it was a great night's sleep. And look at you, I tossed and turned. The wee blue high gear pillow I've got in there just keeps deflating after half an hour with your weight on it, no matter how much I tighten it. But that's where I slept last night. Got the X beds uh, there, and then the one under it I've got, it was the Aldi one. The orange one. Just uh, it was there in the back of the car, the orange one. And then I came with the gear and I was like, I'll just put that up. Uh, the extra little bit stops a wee bump from the chairs being folded down. But Bugsy's gave us a donut and uh looking out a coffee soon. But Stuart and Glenn are away. Uh, Glenn woke up around about four in the morning, really, really like soaked through. A lot to do with condensation, and that was his Hilleberg tent actually. I don't know what kind it is. It's like the wee tunnel one. We look at the the Bergus Peak there at Bugsy's in. Too small for me. And uh, your man Colin there, Scottish Wonder, was under his head in his Hennessy hammock. He had the Hennessy tarp over it, plus the big, large DD Multicam tarp. <laughs> My fingers are freezing. It was a really wet night last night. Right at the river. And I was already halfway through taking this down. I got Poles delivered with Amazon's one day delivery service. Spring shot, the other one's up there. It actually came in really handy, but it's a poor job for what we had. But it managed to keep us out for a wee while with the It's more like a basin now, so we'll be taking all that down while the rain's off. I've got the butter, I've never had oil, so I'm hoping the fat from this is actually greasing it up. Seems to be doing fine. So the plan is to get the tarp properly coming out, tied into the, the side doors and that once it's properly done. Firebox for the fire pit, maybe some wind burners, uh, windbreakers, sorry. And uh, my chair was sitting here with at least a good, uh, I say, I say, a good five feet worth of the tarp coming out from the roof. Cooking appliance, the bed if I need it, if it's not the the tent. So it's coming slowly but surely. So stay tuned. Windy here, in the Galloway Forest. 
think we're looking good. There's more smells than a car can smell. Trust me, this is good. <laughs> Never one for hot chocolate really, I could never get it right when I was younger. But uh Cadbury's has gone down a treat. Cheers. Cheers. Good meeting. I don't forget to check out Kevin's channel guys. He's uh with 30 years worth of experience photographer. He gets round about, he's got the camper van, he's into the wild camping. There's a lot to come as he starts up now on YouTube. Yeah. Raven about Scotland. Raven, as in the, the crow. Raven about Scotland. Check him out. Cheers. Thank you. Nice. Good, yeah. Good. Yeah. 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 One of the things I didn't realise is that the, the robins are migrated first as well, they come to Russia. Ah. Yeah. You've got your main ones that stay in the UK, but in the winter time there's a, a rain coming across. There's another one up north too. Give us a thumbs up, hit the like button, and don't forget to subscribe to be notified of the coming videos. Catch you next time.